Welcome to the Rusted Garden Homestead. In today's two minute tip video, I wanna show you how to easily build a heavy duty trellis. Trellising is wonderful because it allows you to save space in your garden, you can grow more. For instance, these are two six foot um, pieces of railing. You can buy them pre-made at Home Depot or Lowe's or you can make them yourself, I'll go over that in a second. But that's six feet this way, six feet up there that's a 12 feet span that when you put these together and build your triangle in a four foot space or so you can have a 12 foot vine if that makes sense trellising basically saves you space and you can put more crops into your garden these are pre-bought if you want to build it yourself you'll need four two by four by sixes the the bigger pieces right there and then you can buy this deck railing it's pretty inexpensive right now it's more expensive because the price of wood um, has gone up due to covid but over time it's going to come back down. So you can buy it pre-made like this. You can repurpose this if you have family or friends that are, you know, taking decks down or you, you know, see them roadside, you can pick them up. If you want to build them yourself, this is a deck railing and you'll need one, two, three, four, five, about 15 of them for each side. And then you need the two by four by sixes. And the whole key is just put the first piece in straight and then you use a piece of a two by four to create the spacing. You just put in your piece of rail and you work the two by four going all the way up. If you buy your own material, these are going to be a little bit bigger. You can expand the width of your frame or you can leave them hanging over the edge, however you want to do it. But you're basically building something that is six feet tall. I wouldn't go much higher than that. The other materials you're going to need, you're going to need some one and a quarter inch screws and you're going to need six inch hinges to secure this together. So let me show you how to put it together. When you put in your rails, you want to make sure you use at least two screws that keeps it more sound and the shape won't change. I said these were six inch hinges I believe they're eight inch hinges and when you set this up this is the underside of my trellis you just want to make sure you set up the hinge so that when you close it it closes all the way this way we can close over this 12 foot structure into a six foot piece and it'll make for easy storage when you set it up make sure you leave a space so that the two pieces of wood don't rub against each other when you close it and it closes easily and then we would just put in our one inch screws on both sides and that pretty much builds a 12 foot trellis that you can just close over and store as a six foot piece. Let me show you what it looks like in the garden. Make sure you get eight inch heavy duty hinges. They're all screwed in. I didn't, figured you didn't need to see that in the video. Both sides and again this is 12 feet long so you're going to take that 12 foot vine and put it into a space of about four feet and you can see that it just folds over nice and easily and we'll take this out into the garden. Here is the finished trellis. Please subscribe. I do two minute gardening tip videos every week and I'll be doing a whole series on all the different trellises you see here uh, probably this weekend. So it's set up, it's expanded so it's taking up maybe three feet by four feet. You can expand it wider if you want going out that way. But that is perfect. That's 12 feet of growing space going vertically instead of growing that vine all the way out this way. I'll be able to get in many more plants by using this simple design and all we really did was put some of those hinges on there if you're not going to build it yourself you can buy it pre-made set up like this it's deck railing last thing you want to do put in a screw here and over on that side so that you can run a chain or a piece of rope so that when you set it up to the peak that you want Tie it off or chain it off, this way it won't expand open. This is really heavy, really sturdy. You can use it for anything in your garden and you will enjoy having it as part of your garden. Thanks for watching and please check out my seed shop at therustedgarden.com.